On December 9th, DJI launched the application process for users who wants to obtain the new class identification label for the Mavic 3 and the Mavic 3 Cine. I have some pretty good news for you if you are a drone pilot in Europe, or should I rather say EU, not to offend our British friends. And fly under the EU EASA drone rules and have bought a Mini 3 or a Mavic 3 without a class identification label. For those of you that already watched my Mini 3 review would know that this drone does not come with a C0 label out of the box. And the reason why the C0 label is not included is because the drone is still part of the certification process. The story is different if you bought one of the more expensive Mavic 3 drones that did not come with the C1 label and thereby forcing the drone to fly in the A2 airspace. It makes a huge difference and it's important for you to understand having a C1 label on your drone will make the legislation a lot easier on you. Because you will be able to fly the Mavic 3 in the A1 open category in urban areas without the need for establishing a 50 meter safety zone. Giving you a lot more freedom to get the job done. And you can fly the drone by only obtaining the A1, A3 drone certificate. So it's no longer a requirement that you pass the A2 remote piloting license that is way more difficult, costly and at least time consuming. But you can change this now and get your Mavic 3 retroactively certified. This does not apply to the Classic as this one carries the C1 label already. On December 9th, DJI launched the application process for users who wants to obtain the new class identification label for the Mavic 3 and the Mavic 3 Cine you will be able to request a C1 certificate. It's voluntarily and it's free. The process seems pretty simple and straightforward. I will walk you through the steps. If you follow the link I've included in the description below, you will end up on this website for the application process. The application process consists of these five easy steps. Step one, make sure that your DJI Fly app is 109 or later and your Mavic 3 is running the latest firmware. Step two, once you fire up the drone, you will be prompted with a dialog where you can apply for the class identification label. If you decide to use the not now option, you can continue the process later on the consumer service area of the app. Step three, when you press apply, you will be asked to fill in an application and your C1 label will be shipped to you by mail within a certain time frame. There will be no tracking number for the label as shipping is highly dependent on local factors. Step four, once you get the label, you need to attach it per instructions to the drone. Once attached, you need to upload an image in the Fly app to the customer service certification label application section as proof. Step five, your documentation that the drone complies with C1 will become available within three working days, where you can download a PDF that you can carry with you when you're out flying. The process seems very easy and uncomplicated. I don't need to do it because I already got the label on my drone. I guess the biggest concern here is the actual shipping time for the label. It's really great to see this system finally in place. I know I've doubted it a lot along the way, but now it's finally here. And this will definitely make your life a lot easier if you are flying some of the more heavier drones like the Mavic 3. I'm pretty sure that the Mini 3 will follow the same process once that is ready. But it's not so important for the sub 250 gram drones as they are right now allowed to fly in the A1 airspace anyway. And it will be able to do so also after the transition period ends. This just means that the drone will be classified as a legacy drone, but it will still be allowed to fly in the A1 airspace. Let me know how it goes when you have tried it out. I hope you liked this video. If you did, then feel free to give it a like. If you did like it, feel free to press the dislike button twice. Thank you for watching and I'll be seeing you around.